What's up everybody, Iron Sights here. Today we're going to be doing an explosive showcase on the M6 Lamb, but before we do that, I'm going to give you guys a little bit of background about myself. For 11 years, I was in the U.S. Navy, and 8 of them I spent as an explosive ordnance disposal technician. I got out of the U.S. Navy as a master explosive ordnance disposal technician, so I'm going to go over the M6 Lam, talking about real world um, stuff, because this device actually is a real device, and I'm going to talk about the technology and placement and things like that in-game to utilize it better. So the first thing we're going to talk about is the actual technology of the SLAM. The SLAM is an explosively formed penetrator. So what that means is there are explosives behind a copper disc. And when the explosives detonate, it crushes that copper disc into a hot molten piece of metal, which punches straight through armor like it's not even there. So when I was in Iraq in 2006 and 2007, we prosecuted a lot of IEDs. And some of them were improvised versions of the M6 SLAM. These improvised versions were set up so they could hit Hummers and various other armored vehicles on the side of the road. And they used all kinds of methods to hide these things from being seen because if they found them, they would get called in and we would come prosecute them. But I don't want to get too far into the details of the real world because we're freaking talking about a video game. So let's talk about the actual M6 Slam and how to use it effectively. First of all, let's talk about placement. When you place it, you don't have to worry about walking around it. You cannot set it off. You want to place it on the side of the road with the front face towards the road so when a vehicle crosses that plane, it's going to punch right through that vehicle. Now you want to make sure that your piece of ordnance is concealed because the M6 Slam is not exactly um, a covert piece. It sticks out like a sore thumb. So there are a few places that you can hide it such as trees, bushes, around blind curves, around walls, around buildings, anywhere where people are not expecting it and you just can't look down and see it is where you want to have them. Some of my favorite areas to place are multiple intersecting roads, gas stations, base entrances, and um, let's not forget the improvised versions of the M6 land, which is the timer where you can take out the little guard towers, you can take out the single level uh, military base bunkers, and you can take out the big ass towers with these things. One mine will drop an entire tower. That is what I love doing. You can freaking wipe out people who are trying to camp out in those things like it's nobody's business. Alright guys, that's all I got for now. Thanks for watching. I really, really appreciate it. If you want to see me live and say hi, check me out at www.twitch.tv slash iron underscore sites with the Z. And don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And I'm out. Man, somebody's shooting like a motherfucker. You smoked him, guys.